Here's the volley. Nu hier zijn we voor deel 2 van de uh, van deze uitzending van vandaag. We gaan toch moeten beginnen ultra aanvallen, want daar ben ik toch gevaarlijk man. Dat is niet goed. Die doelman, daar heb ik nog nog geugen van. En maar ik wil nog ook. Dat was de enige deftige match van de Belgen op 2K, want voor de rest, dat was een ramp. Alles een ramp, tot de kwartfinaal is gehaald. Hey man! Dokter kan stilletjes beginnen. Ultra aanvallen. Well, Arsenal go up against Newcastle United after this, and I just think in attack they haven't taken the chances. They've looked a bit flat today. We're still level in the match, but Everton trying to get in front now. And that will be a throw. And Arsenal are going to bring on some fresh legs. Those uh, defenders will have been told by the coach, stop the cross, that's what he's done. Big big in the mail of the wall. Theo Walcott. Chance for the cross. Cross is in. He goes up to head it away. James McCarthy. Now it's Sacco. Campbell. Wow. Alexis Sanchez. Sanoga. In with a chance. Ooh. A very good save at a very good time. Yeah, it was. And should give the team confidence to go on and perhaps snatch this match. Everton's goalkeeper today in absolutely inspired form. Here was the opportunity, maybe to win the game this late because it's so close here. Oh, he could have uh, made all the headlines in the papers tomorrow, but instead, well, he's going to get some stick off the fans for that. Voilà. Dat is niet goed. Ik denk dat ik best eerst... Oh, 1-1 en daar 2-2. Er is niks veranderd. Qua stand. De Barclays Premier League. Arsenal 0, Everton 0. Liverpool 1, Manchester City 1. Queen's Park Rangers 2, Tottenham Hotspur 2. So what comes next in de Barclays Premier League? Well, second place Chelsea are at home to 20th place Burnley. Fourth placed Arsenal travel to eighth placed Newcastle United. Mm -hmm. 
Nö, nee, muss ich doch nicht. Das ist eine Arbeit. Anton Taylor. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the Barclays Premier League. Newcastle United, two changes for them. Tim Krul starts in goal. Fabrizio Colaccini replaces Mike Williamson, who's looked vulnerable recently. Vernon Anita plays with Cech Tiote in the centre of the park. Emmanuel Riviere is the main striker today. Anthony Taylor, the referee today. Ashley Taylor, yeah. Musa Sissoko. Will that be a throw? Well, we can hear what's happening up at the Hull City KC Stadium with Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Hull City. It's been scored by Hatton Ben Arfa. A speculative yards inexplicably went through the keeper's hands and trickled over the line. Four minutes played, one nil. Cheers, Alan. And Newcastle United. People might forget, finished in the top half of the table in 2013-14. It didn't seem like that, did it? Well, it didn't, mate. There always seems to be a, a soap opera going on up on Tyneside. And this... Got to be! Push back into play. Okay. Also ein Rakit. On the subject of Newcastle, it was a... a it's a quick break. Too many excuses for that because a good effort until it came to the final shot. And then I hate to use the word, but that was hopeless. Oh, the ball was all turned away, and I think the referee did half just expecting to be pointed to the center circle. Alan McAnally's got something to tell us about a goal at the KC Stadium. It's a goal for Queen's Park Rangers. 12 minutes played, 1 1. Thanks, Alan. Crosses in. And here it's the goalkeeper's ball. Walcott. Can he turn away from the challenge here? Jack Wilshire. No, not well, well, he has got some support to his right. Rafael Varad. Here's the shot. He's had a crack. Well, he missed it, hasn't he? What a good chance that was for him. Yeah. Ozil moving forward with menace. Yeah, breaking forward and, and they've got the ball back again. Bronze. That's uh, surprising. Kieran Gibbs. What a chance here. Got to be. Still a chance after that save. Good judgment there to make that interception clear the ball away. Mathieu Debushi. Well, we've got a, a battle within the war today, haven't we, with the player getting his track at his old teammates. Yeah, and I think it's always an emotional time when you face your former club, so you just want to concentrate on doing yourself justice. La la la. Danny Welbeck, he's inspirational and so industrious as well. Yeah, I mean, he lacks in some areas of his game. He certainly makes up with his work rate. Tackled well. Danny Welbeck. In a goal. All right, penalty. Penalty for Arsenal. Red card for that challenge, Alan, correct? Without a doubt. I think uh, anything other than that, and uh, he would have been in trouble from his superiors. 
Well, that's risky going in like that. Yeah, I think so. And it was a poor tackle. It was badly timed. Yes, 0 in. Had his eye on the keeper all the time, but in the end, down the middle. So it's Arsenal with the lead. And the goal for Arsenal in the 29th minute, number 23. Theo Walcott with the afterburners on there. And the cross is in. Strong header away. Cross is moved up to be. Well, then he's got the ball well to sit his team on the front foot by intercepting. Played it into the wide area there, played it well. And in he goes with the tackle. Ramsey. Danny Welbeck. Well, it's Arsenal holding a slender advantage as we count down towards half time. And still a few questions for them to answer in this game. Sanchez. This could be a chance. Oh, what an opportunity! In with a chance. Yeah, no three. Here with a great goal. Well, we don't always see the advantage come good, but they've made use of it here, haven't they? The goal from Welbeck, and that's gone like a torpedo into the bottom right-hand corner. What a shot! And here is another angle on that goal. Uit een linkervoet deze keer. Now it's 2-0. The MZO. We're going to win it. Good strong tackle. We well, could be in. In it goes on goal. Here's the chance. He might be needed again, the goalkeeper. Trying to find Alexis Sanchez. Riviere. Didn't hesitate, did he, with that challenge? Nibush is there. He passed not far. Cool is that, huh? Nu de meer echt de match, deze match. Gaan on Anita. Wacht, Askus, Ay. Karen Gibbs. Kijk. Het was mooi geprobeerd. Oeh la la. Maar we hebben gewoon een paar keer gezet vandaag. Well, the big moment of the first half probably was the penalty award. The penalty that was converted and helped the team to have this half-time lead. Yeah, they got a bit of help from the ref, but give them credit. They got themselves into the box. It was a good move that led to the penalty. With the money gone. Teams all set and they're ready for the start of the second period. Newcastle's chance now. Got to be. Off the post. Oof, that's any good luck you have. 